Hi, I'm Jeff Rose with Twisted Throttle. When we talk about motorcycle protection, you probably think about products like crash guards, engine case covers, axle and bar end sliders, and frame sliders first. These are all worthy products, but have you thought about your bike's paint? For years, manufacturers like 3M have been offering paint protection for cars, trucks, and SUVs to protect many parts of those types of vehicles susceptible to damage from road debris. When it comes to your motorcycle, stones thrown up from the road can ding parts of your fairing, other debris can take the paint right off the fork lowers and fenders. It doesn't have to be that way. That's where RNG's Second Skin system comes in. Second Skin is a paint protection film system for a wide range of bikes. So far, there are applications for more than 60 models available, with more coming soon too. Every Second Skin kit is designed for a specific bike with precision cut polyurethane film that's less than one millimeter thick. The film is UV protected to reduce the chances of yellowing over time as well. Each section is designed to fit the bike's bodywork perfectly. Having the film cut out precisely makes installation much easier, as I'll show you on our company BMW R1200 GS. Before we get started, it's worth remembering though that this process works best in warmer weather. RNG does not recommend performing this installation when your shop is colder than 55 degrees. Start by cleaning the bodywork thoroughly, following up with a degreaser or some of the isopropyl alcohol wipes included in the kit. Take the included spray bottle and fill it with clean water. It actually already contains the correct proportion of a concentrate that will make a good installation solution when you add the water to it. Then find the piece you want to install first on the sheet of film and remove it from the backing sheet. Use the spray bottle to put down a thin layer of lubricant to the bodywork itself and then spray the adhesive side of the film. Be sure you only touch that adhesive side when it's wet or you'll leave fingerprints that will be visible through the film once it's on the bike, which we don't want to do. Carefully place the part and center it on the bodywork. The fitting solution will give you time to fine tune this placement, so don't panic. Take your time, get it situated properly. The next step is to fix one end of the film and using the supplied squeegee, remove the air from between the film and the bodywork itself. Depending on the piece, you may want to work from the middle out or you may find it easier to work from one edge to the other. Try to avoid going backward if you can. Keep going until there's no air entrapment and if you should get any creases in the film, keep working towards the edges. If you can't get it to lay down, don't worry. You can lift the film, respray it with some of the solution and try again. Patience is the key here. Finally, wipe down the area to remove any excess solution and carefully use a hairdryer or heat gun on the low setting to warm up the film to ensure a strong lasting bond. Be careful not to overheat, you're just trying to activate that adhesive on the back. And that's it. Go to twistedthrottle.com to find the right RNG second skin application for your bike. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.